Hello everyone! I know this is a little bit shocking and something that doesn't seem like I'd be doing, but I feel like I could give back to you guys by doing something that you've all been requesting, because I see it in the comments of my videos all the time. I'm giving you guys a chance to be in one of the roleplays that we're doing. So, first of all, to start it off, obviously you guys gotta know which one we're doing it in, and it is the deserted roleplay, because with the way that I'm making it, it needs a couple more people in it. And I feel like what better people to participate in it than the fans. But there... <laughs> don't kill me when I say this, but there are some requirements that are being implemented into these auditions. First of all, the roleplay is in Minecraft. I know, cringy as it is, but it is in Minecraft, as you guys saw in the roleplays to come 2019 video. So the first requirement is that you have to have the game, because you can't be in a roleplay if you don't have the damn game. And the second one, it's gonna sound like I'm being picky, but again, with the way that this thing is going, it makes sense. Um, you can't be a squeaker. <laughs> um, as weird as that sounds, it, it it makes a little bit of sense, because it just, if you guys know what a squeaker is, then you'll obviously know why I don't want them in. The third requirement is that it doesn't seem like it takes that long, but you have to be able to work long periods of recording time. So I'm talking like maybe up to like three to four hours on something. It, it sounds a little bit ridiculous when I say it out loud, but the time does pass by really fast, and that's approximately about not the time that it takes us to actually record an episode. In the actual episode, it doesn't take that long, because I cut some shit out, and most of it is discussing about what happened in it, but yeah, that's the third requirement. You have to be flexible with long recording hours. The fourth requirement, because of the fact, again, like I keep saying in the video, with the way that the roleplay is going, you have to be decent at screaming and reacting not extremely fast, but don't, like, lag on an event that happens. So an example of that is, if you see someone die, don't wait, like, five seconds to start freaking out. Like, you gotta be, like, pretty quick. Okay, this next one, I wouldn't necessarily say it's a requirement. It's more of a need. Uh, for the people that are actually going to participate in this audition, I want you guys to have fun with it. Like, I get it, you're, like, sort of competing for a role that you may or may not get, but, like, I want you guys to enjoy it, and I want this to be a fun experience for everyone, so I'm gonna try to make it as fair as possible. I am going to be judging on all those requirements that I listed before, and a little bit of other stuff that I'm gonna throw in. Like just basic things, like acting and all that shit. So, I just wanted to tell you guys that I'm doing that, and I will give you guys a date right now. And what I will also be doing is I'm going to put my gamer tag on the actual screen right now. That way, so in case if you are actually participating in this audition, you can find me, you can message me, you can do whatever just to let me know that you are participating in it, and I will count you off with pretty much everyone else that's going to be doing it. Alright guys, that is it. I just wanted to notify you guys that I was doing that, just in case if you wanted to be in the roleplays, because I know a lot of you have asked to be in them. I just figured I'll give you guys something back for all the support that I've gotten through this past almost year, actually. Uh, the one year anniversary of this channel will be next month, and that's actually really crazy, so I thought I'd give something back to you guys, and give you guys a chance to be in a roleplay. But before I sign off, I will tell you one little thing, and it's that I am looking for two roles to be filled in. So if you don't get the part for one person, there is a chance that you can get it for another person. And I know a lot of you that will be auditioning will sadly leave without a spot, but don't discourage yourself if I don't pick you. You were probably all extremely good actors, but I'm just looking for a specific thing for this role. So, again, I hope to see you guys there on February 16th, and I want to see how good your acting is. Have a good night, guys.